Hey, how you doing? It's Derek Lau with the September 2014 Atom Media Minute. In celebration of the announcement of the release of the GoPro 4, in this video I'm going to be giving you some GoPro tips and tutorials. Stay tuned. All right, so unless you've been living under a rock lately, I'm sure you've heard of one of these little guys right here. This is the GoPro. Uh, it started out as you know more of a hobbyist, you know, fun action camera to you know put on your dirt bike or your motorcycle or you know your your, your skateboard or whatever you want to put it on to kind of catch you know action sports and fun things like that. But it's becoming more and more prevalent, more and more popular, and you're starting to see it all over the place. Uh, Today, they released an announcement of when the GoPro 4 will come out, which will actually have 4K resolution. Now, I'm not gonna bore you with too much techno geek jargon right here and tell you all about all the features, but um, a lot of businesses are using them and a lot of people are implementing them into their video strategies. Uh, over the past year or so, we've been using the GoPro more and more and more to get videos in tight spaces that we can't really stick our expensive cameras, uh, places that are dangerous or underwater or muddy or things like that. So uh, if you want to learn about GoPros, uh, our first you know, lesson is going to be about some of the different mounts and things like that. So I'm going to talk to you about some of the sticky mounts and places you can put the GoPro. Uh, as far as some of the videos we've been making lately, uh, the one that I really want to share with you is an animation piece that we created. It's animations and motion graphics that we've been working on most of the summer for Wheatland Federal Credit Union. Uh, check it out. It's all about banking local and has all kinds of scenes from Lancaster County as well. Some of them are stock photos, uh, but a lot of it's uh, a lot of local content. Uh, the other video I wanted to talk to you about was, uh, you know, you, you know you're, you're getting to the fall, you're raking up the leaves, you're cutting your grass, um, you know, you're doing some landscaping, is a video we created for a company called Turf Tech and SpecFab. Uh, they have some really cool uh, equipment for landscapers and property managers and things like that. We actually used the GoPro on that video, so, so check that one out as well. And if you've been driving up and down 30 and 896 in the Strasburg and Burden Hand area lately, I'm sure you're seeing all those New York and New Jersey license plates. You know, it's uh, the tail end of the tourist season. So the other video I wanted to share with you was a new one that we created for the Amish Village. Uh, it's called, you know, Explore the Amish Village. It has some kids running through, having a good time. There's a lot of good shots in there that I really like and I hope you'll enjoy. Our, our blog post has to do with the pigskin. You know, it's football season, you know, Sundays and Monday nights, everyone's watching the games. Uh, you're hearing everybody on Facebook talking trash about who's going to the Super Bowl. Uh, we wrote a blog picking out our top five football movies. Now, we've already got some comments on there that we missed a couple, but those are great ideas for next year's blog. So, uh, you know, read up on those. If you haven't seen those movies and you're a football fan, you know, give them a, give them a watch and, and check them out. And if you're wondering what this thing is here beside me, uh, this is the uh, Quick Picks. It is a digital media player that you can use at trade shows, uh, in lobbies, and things like that. Um, I have some similar digital media players that, that go in our hotel video system, but I've, I've met with uh, Jeff Donbach from JLD Systems, and he introduced me to this new uh, piece of machinery here. Uh, it's pretty cool. It's really easy to use. You don't even have to use a remote control or anything like that. You actually just plug a USB drive in the back, and it automatically just plays over and over and over again for, you know, as, as long as you can dream of. If it does ever get uh, caught up and hiccup, all you gotta do is unplug it, plug it right back in, and it just starts playing and playing continuously. Uh, this is one of the smaller models. They have some other models as well. You can put your logo on there. I think it's really cool. We're gonna start using them with our business. If you want any more information about the Quick Pick systems, uh, there's gonna be a link at the end of the video. Uh, you can listen to Jeff, and he's gonna tell you a little bit more about it. But I'm really excited to use it in our business. And if you're someone that's watching this that might be able to use this for your business, you know, let us know. Um, you know, I'd be glad to tell you about it and let you know how it's working out for us. So that's all we got for you this month. Check out the tutorials. Uh, you know, play with your GoPro. You know, take it out, get some fun footage. You know, share it with me. Let me see what you got. You know, put some comments below if you got any links to GoPro videos already. You know, put them down there. I'd like to check them out. Uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and uh, you can check out these other videos here that I mentioned. And I will see you in October.